at night and uh, we're sitting in uh, Hopkins, Hop yeah, Hopkins, Minnesota um, at uh, Super Value or UNFI, whatever it is nowadays. Uh, we're sitting up here. We have been here since 6 a.m. this morning. Um, this load had a 10 o'clock appointment uh, Tuesday night. Uh, it did not get loaded until 1.30 Wednesday morning, I was on the road with it by 2 a.m., got up here by 6.30 a.m. out of Osceola. Um, yeah, and we've sat here ever since. It's it's uh, not my fault. Just another one of them, I guess, is what it is things. So, um, yeah, I guess I'm kind of starting my video off here. Um, Hadn't been a lot to shoot. Drove all through the night. Uh, and here they're calling to give me a door. Just a second. Hello. Yes, this is him. Uh, no, no, this is the only stop. Five sounds good. I appreciate it. Yep, thank you. And just like that, we're back in a door. So, anyway, um, yeah. So we didn't make our appointment. Uh, we're here it's right at ten o'clock now. Back in the door. We're gonna get unloaded. Uh, we got to go over to Lakeville, Minnesota. Reload out of Cloverleaf take that back down to Osceola and then the plan was to grab a Morris Illinois go to Costco deliver there Thursday morning that ain't gonna happen um, have another one in Bartlett deliver that and then reload out of McCook right back to Osceola that was gonna be you know pretty simple week 1500 miles uh, and a whole bunch of money <laughs> um, no I a little bit of money not a couple bucks something like that but I don't think that's going to work out. I don't know. We'll see. Um, don't have, you know, really any reason to be home. Well, I shouldn't say that. Because I'll say that, and then my wife will watch this video, and I'll get in trouble. <laughs> uh, I always have a reason to be home, obviously. But I don't have uh, eons of plans and kids tournaments and such and such to take care of. So... Uh, we might work a little bit this weekend. We'll see what happens. But, uh... Okay, so I'm back here. I, uh, got sidetracked there with the dog and everything and, uh, had to help him out get some food. So, anyway, uh, I want to leave this fairly short. Uh, wanted to give a quick shout out to Kale from Wisconsin. Uh, Kale and I uh, crossed paths last night at Hormel in Osceola and uh, thanks for the conversation. It was a pleasure to meet you sir. Uh, still digging that purple uh, color on that Kenworth there and uh, I seen you pull out there when I was sitting in the door and I'm digging that spread too. So um, like I said last week this is uh, the second time in the last two loads that I've been ousted. If you guys see me somewhere uh, come up, say hi, I'll buy you a cup of coffee, um, and I'll talk your ear off. Uh, it's a pleasure to meet each and every one of you that I've, uh, I've met thus far and come across. Thank you for your support, uh, you know, through YouTube and, uh, my other social media outlets that I've, uh, extended out there. I appreciate your guys' support. You, uh, continue to make this enjoyable, and, uh, it's always, um, entertaining and fun to meet new people and uh, you know network in, in different ways so uh, don't be bashful don't be shy uh, I'd glad to be you know like I said be glad to sit down and have a cup of coffee with you and buy a meal so uh, all that being said I'm gonna go lay down for a little bit try to catch some shut eye uh, we're going to get out of here as soon as they'll let us out of here and we're gonna head down to Cloverleaf Clothes Storage in Lakeville Minnesota 
hopefully load that yet tonight, but it'll probably be tomorrow morning. That'll go back to Osceola, and uh, we'll see what's happening with the rest of the party from there. So uh, we will talk with you guys tomorrow morning. <laughs>
I have been sick more in the last year than I have my entire life. <coughs> Excuse me, I sneezed. Um, so anyway, we're going to spend the night at home, relax. I did call the doctor uh, to kind of, you know, talk him through my symptoms and see. Um, and it is what I expected. Um, it's lack of tacos. Uh, so my doctor did recommend uh, going home, eating a very large quantity of tacos. So, you know, some people think doctors are whack jobs sometimes. But, you know, at the end of the day, he went to school for 10 years, so he's got to know what he's talking about. But, um, anyway, tomorrow there is a little truck show display thing over at the Adams County Speedway. Um, I'm going to try to go to that if I feel good. I don't know. We'll see. But if I do, I'll try to get footage of that. Um, but, uh, you know, you just make 10 or 12 laps or something around the track, you know, and kind of show your trucks off at night. It's it's kind of a cool deal. They started doing it last year, and I didn't make it. Um, so we might try to do that. I didn't wash the truck uh, today because... As you can see off into the abyss there, it's getting ready to rain. And Diesel will agree because he's laying down and that never happens. So, all that being said, uh, I'm going to go home and relax. Uh, hopefully feel better tomorrow. If that's the case, I've got to service the green truck, grease, change the oil, and put new batteries in it. And then once that's all taken care of... Uh, health dependent I guess if you will we will get this hose down waxed up and uh, hopefully go make a couple passes around the track so thanks for coming along again with me this week I appreciate it as always um, we'll catch you guys on the flip side